Uh, good day everyone and welcome before we start we have a disclosure please be aware of risk in the future trading we strongly recommend to stay on a sim as long as needed get educated before you start using real money uh, we are a little bit early for Monday morning and uh, we still have tons of uh, charts on the Nasdaq it's still open position so what we will do we will cover it just uh, the morning session uh, at the moment the market is going one direction only one direction and it's been an uh, amazing day for monday this is really surprising uh, we're gonna start with the dax uh, on a six range uh, 1759 for the range lover uh, on the one minute DAX, uh, 1,400. Uh, we, we started the DAX a little bit late today. Uh, on the NASDAQ, 150 ticks, we got, uh, we got 1,900. Uh, this is uh, on uh, 150 ticks for the tick slower. Uh, the NASDAQ on the one minute, one shot, uh, it was 12,120. And it was done at around 14.14. Around 2.14, it was one straight shot. And uh, that was a beautiful trade. On the NASDAQ 200, uh, took uh, two trades. And it was 1,165. Uh, on the NASDAQ 7 range, for the range lovers, I mean, the range is doing very fine as well on the nasdaq is uh, 2080 this is the new auto trade and without any optimization turn it on turn it off you can optimize this in new auto trade this is our latest release and um and uh, without any optimization it just today we're only running the new automated trade it was released to our trader uh around a couple weeks ago in your package there is around 15 auto trades so uh, this is we're running uh, the latest strategy without even any optimization it's the same setting on all of them straight out of the box no trading stop no stop loss the system taking over predicting the short trades and the long trades on the nasdaq 9 range uh, 1330 uh, on the YM, 1,865. On the NASDAQ 8 range, because all of them, they are on $1,000 target. But uh, if this market go into your direction, it's going to stay. As an example, we have the NASDAQ here short, 22,000. Still, the target is on 1,000. So when we have a trade... Uh, I will show an example. If we have a trade and the market go in one direction, uh, it's going to stay uh, to your favor. Like this YM. And uh, you can also use the trading stop. You can use the trading stop automatic. Or you can uh, do it manually if you want to. And you can secure some of the profit or if you want to you can have it automatic 20 30 50 takes and it will be automatic the reason i like for me making a decision on the trading stop because i use fips but if you don't know how to use fips you can have an automatic trailing stop and it will stay on that trade so if you notice here the trade was taken from that area here and it's still going to the short trade and everything is this on are still on the same trade 7400 so let's say we want to get out of those trades you can secure as much as you want and then and then, then uh, you can um, 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 uh, or if you want to you can wait till the system uh, take a, uh, a close the trade for you and uh, uh, as an example, um, this is the system where 
without the trailing stop, the system decided to exit in here on the YM two minutes, and it was 2070. So there is both of direction. You can override the auto trade. You can have the auto trade close position. And um, sometimes if you let the auto trade itself, as we see from the controller here, uh, you wind up maybe if the market trending, you're gonna wind up with a little bit more when the market is not trending and you have a couple thousand dollar profit you don't take it maybe it's going to go against you so this is something we teach you uh, free uh, when you become a member so eight range it is uh, 1055 and uh, nasdaq 10 range uh, 1425 uh, the CL the CL has been amazing. The CL because of the crisis worldwide, and uh, the CL two thousand three hundred forty. It is actually a few years ago. Everyone stopped trading CL because everyone was trading CL, and now start to reminding me a few years back where everyone trading CL. Uh, the CL become a really uh, something else. Uh, the CL five range uh, sixteen hundred. Uh, CL 8 range 2700, the CL 1 minute 2170, and then the Russell 2 minute, also the Russell lately and the gold. I mean, the whole market is moving up and down because of all the crisis worldwide. The Russell on the 2 minutes is 4300, the CL on 100 take 3300, one shot, one trade, and it was done. Beautiful entry, beautiful exit, and it is done without any optimization. On the CL 9 range, 3360, on the Russell 150 takes. Um, you know, I have an Australian, we just installed the system for him and I just put it straight out of the box uh, for him. And I think, I believe it was, uh, the installation was on Friday. A uh, few minutes after we did the installation for him, he sent a message, target hit this morning, Australia time, target hit. And the guy has not even touched it. It's still on the same setting, straight out of the box from Friday. And, uh, and uh, he just sent a message Sam from early morning. Sam, everything hit. So uh, he has six. He's he still don't know how to run the software. We just set it up for him, and he start hitting the targets. Uh, uh, ES six range did very well. The ES six range, it is five thousand four hundred on the ES. A beautiful shot. A beautiful trade. Exit. This is the auto trade predicted where to exit, not us. And you can see how pullback re-entry, identifying short, taking the trade, exit by itself on a perfect time. And this is welcome to 2022. It's no longer, you can come with a donkey ATR and you think you're gonna be, because you have to think about the others are using smarter tools than you are and they are more experienced. So you cannot come uh, lagging out of uh, uh, updates for the last 20 years and you think you're going to survive in this market in 2022. If you're not updated emotionally, physically, uh, mentally, and your auto trade is shiny, your internet is very smooth. If you don't have all those tools, you don't have the proper training for the auto trade, then you are wasting your time. It's not just buying an auto trade, it is also know and how to use the auto trade when to use the auto trade how to can get the most out of your auto trade it's not a dishwasher machine you just turn it on in the morning and start pumping out money for you so if you don't do those basic you have no chance to survive sorry to tell you that it's not a fairy tale a trading is not fairy tale and an auto trade is not a fairy tale an auto trade require also management. If you don't have the management, the knowledge, uh, you can uh, crash any system. Uh, the CL200 takes, uh, it is uh, uh, 2,000, 200 takes with 2,000, this is very funny. Uh, we still have some open and trade. As you see, 
Uh, the Nasdaq is way on the top is 22,000, 23,000. And we can go to the ES is 13, 14,000. Still uh, not even uh, that we have the YM 10,000. We have the DAX 9,000. So still, we still have a lot of uh, open in the trades. And uh, some of them, they are much more than the other. Uh, I mean, if we, uh, the ES is coming right behind. You can see all the ES come right behind the NASDAQ. After the NASDAQ, there is the YM come behind is around on the $7,000 range. And then the gold uh, comes after that. So, uh, uh, so this is how things work. And then uh, we have the NASDAQ for range 1,700. NASDAQ 100 tick, beautiful trade, 3,640. 2,700 on the ES for range, Russell 8 range, 3,525. Uh, uh, the Russell on the, also the Russell on the range, they've been doing very well. Uh, 2270, the Russell on six range, 18. 1450, a little bit chop on the 200 takes, the life will come to trade in. And the Russell on the nine range, it is 3560. And on the Russell, uh, 200, 3360. Folks, that's all what we have for you today. And uh, we wish you a really pleasant evening. And uh, tomorrow we will uh, see you live uh, on the, the other channel. We wish you a very wonderful, pleasant evening. Bye for now.